Hey, it's Mike Hayden from IntelliWolf, and today we're going to look at the responsive widths in Elementor. So first up, if you're in a hurry, the defaults uh, for desktop is going to be more than 125 pixels, tablet is going to be 768 to 1024 pixels, and mobile size is going to be under 767 pixels. Okay, so what do I mean by all that? So if you uh, come into edit section, the responsive, you'll see we've got hide on desktop, hide on tablet, hide on mobile. So uh, with those sizes, if it's going to, so hide on desktop is going to be when the screen width is more than 1025 pixels, hide on tablet between 768 and 1024, and uh, as you can see with hide on mobile. All right, so those are the, those are the mobile, the responsive breakpoints. So how do they look in action? All right, so we've got this page here. Let's in, let's use the inspector Oops. Uh, on responsive mode. So if you can see up the top, uh, we're changing the widths. So let's change it to 1025. All right, so that's 1025. This is still in desktop mode. But then under this, we've got it set at uh, tablet mode and you can't really tell the difference with that until we get to mobile mode so let's just uh, make a quick change yeah, said edit the selection and we're going to hide it on tablet just so that we can see that it is actually doing something on tablet mode so it's going to hide this middle section so I'll just refresh that and then as we get smaller as you can see under 1025 under that, the very next pixel, and it's gone. All right, it's going to come back once we hit mobile, and it's going to be in the mobile format. So real quick again, those are 1025, and as you can see on the screen, if you ever forget these, which it's easy to do, uh, the way that you find it, you just come over under your dashboard, we've got Elementor, we've got Settings, and then Style, and then at the bottom here, you've got Tablet Breakpoint, so this is where it switches to Tablet, uh, is under 1025, and switches to Mobile under 768, those are the defaults. So those are the mobile responsive breakpoints for Elementor and how you can find them.